Happy Friday. Today is Friday, September 16th. Um, I'm just waiting for Lonnie to get home from work because we have some errands to run. Um, it is like 1.41 in the afternoon. I'm actually working on um, our travel vlog that we, our recent trip we just went on. So that's what I'm working on. Coco's laying right here in her little bed with me. So I'm waiting for him to get home. What did I want to say? I wanted to say, oh, I've had a busy morning. Um, I've been up since like 6.30. And I left the house at 7.30 this morning because I had to drop my truck off. I had to drop Pearl off because I had to go take her to the um, dealer so she could get service. You know, we like to, y'all know we don't, we don't have, our cars are like super duper old, but we like to keep them in tip top shape so that they'll last a long, long time. Because Pearl is what, like I got her in 2009. So what's that make her like 13, 13, 14 years old? Because y'all know, I don't, we don't like car payments. So we will run our cars until the suckers won't go anymore. But we try to keep them in tip top shape so they'll last us a long, long time. But yeah, so I went to, um, I went to drop the car off and then I called the lift and the lift took me to my, cause I had a mammogram appointment today. So the lift took me to the mammogram appointment and then I had to call another lift to take me back to the car dealership so I could wait for it to get finished. And then I came home and now I'm just waiting for him to get home so we can go run these errands cause we need to go to the grocery store. We have no food in the house. Um, what else? I did clean up around here because the dust in here was just, I couldn't take it anymore. I couldn't take it anymore. It just was not smelling fresh in here. And I was just like, I got to clean this house. So I did that um, yesterday evening. But yeah, so hopefully we'll be able to go and look at some rugs today too. There's some things I want to go look at after we run these errands. So when we're running the errands, I'll bring y'all with us. But I just want to say, I hope you guys all are doing well. Hope everything's going good for everybody. Hope everybody's had a great week. And I'll see you when he gets home when we go out and hit these streets. Happy Saturday, family. It is Saturday. What's today's date? The 17th, September 17th. And not much is going to be going on today. They're going to come back. Fred, well, I don't know if Mr. Jimmy's coming by today because he hurt his shoulder. But Fred and an, and his son are going to be here working today. So I'm just going to show you where they left off from last weekend when we were away. And then I'll show you the progress at the end of today's vlog. Hold on a second. Guys, where they left off last time, they got the back wall done. It looks so good. It looks so, so good. And then they're going to work on that side today. And I'm not sure what else they're going to do. They're probably going to do the floor. I don't know exactly what they're going to do today. But all I know is work is getting done in here and I'm just happy about it. So yeah, so that's what's going on. I'm about to go work on my vlog so that I can try to get it up tomorrow because I didn't have time to edit this week and I started editing yesterday and I got a, well, I still have a lot more to go. Y'all don't realize how much goes into editing these videos. If you do YouTube, then you know. If you don't, then you really don't know. You don't know how long it takes like to edit just a five minute piece of footage. A five a five minute video can take hours and hours of work. But then y'all know my videos don't be five minutes. They're longer than five minutes. So it takes come on, boo boo. So it takes a long, long time and a lot of work to put the video together. So make sure y'all watch. And if you watch to the end, please put a heart at the end of this video so that I know you watched it. And another thing, um, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below um, so that you can become an official part of the family, okay? And I'd appreciate it so, so much. So let's get back to the video. I told, oh, my hair is coming down. I know I told y'all I was gonna um, vlog me running errands yesterday, but I completely forgot. <laughs> so I did go to the grocery store. Hold on one second. This is not anything on my shirt. It's like oil on my shirt. So we, I did go grocery shopping yesterday. I didn't buy a lot. I think the rest of the stuff that I didn't get, I'm going to just order from Amazon Prime and just have Whole Foods deliver it because I don't feel like going to no grocery store and I got a lot of work to do. Mommy, what you doing today? Wait a second. Hmm? What are you doing? What do you do today? I just got a little projects around the house that I need to complete. Yeah. You going to get them complete? What's I'm that? Try to. What is that? 
Follow the light down, put it in the back and front. Oh, okay. All right, well, cool. Take Coco for a little walk real quick. I usually take her for a long walk in the evenings. We used to go for like um, 45 minutes to an hour. I try to walk her twice a day, but this morning I'm just gonna take her for a short little walk. Just to let her get some exercise. I had to come back to the tile store because we ran out of wall tile. I needed another box, so I ordered two boxes, but they don't have the tile at this store. So I have to drive out to another tile shop that's about 35 minutes away. So I already paid for the tile here. I just need to go there and pick it up. So that's what we're about to go do. So I made it to the tile shop, the different one. I had to drive all the way out to Timonium. If you live in Maryland, then you know that that's far as hell. Well, it's far as hell from where I live. So, but I made it. So now I'm gonna run in and go pick up this tile and then hopefully they can get the, what they need to do done. Sometimes these people in these businesses don't be seeming the most friendly, but they sure will take your money. If I didn't need this tile, I definitely wouldn't get it. They've gone to lunch. Let's take a peek and see how far they've gotten. I haven't been filming while they have been working because I haven't been here because I was running to the tile store. But it looks good. Getting that part done and see. They've done the little insert part and crowned it. It looks good. It's looking good. Yes. So... What alcove box looks like. It looks so good. Happy with the choices that we made. I'm sorry if this is boring right now, but I gotta get this work done. So let me get this video done and work on this and I'll catch back up with you guys later. Guys, so they got this side done and it looks so good. It looks so, so good. Let me show you up close. So it actually worked out. I was a little nervous because I wasn't sure how this tile was going to look on this side, but it actually looks really, really good. And from a distance, it looks like it's like a little iridescent gray. But yeah, so I had to stack it this way, and then this is what it looks like in the inside. And then I had them trim it with this, with this trim. And I think it looks really, really good. I like it. Then at first, we were trying to determine if he asked me if I wanted this tile here the gray tile and I was like I felt like this tile would have been too much there so I wanted the gray in here so I think it turned out good crazy I'm so crazy but y'all like girl you only look crazy but anyway I need to go to Home Depot and get paint it's just so much it's a lot but oh well let me get back to work oh I just made the um the best little parfait let me show you guys i tried this new yogurt it's um <clears throat> it's dairy free it's um i thought it was gonna be nasty but y'all it was so good i should have showed y'all my little bowl because i did the little yogurt just a little bit maybe like a quarter of a cup with some um strawberries raspberries and blackberries and some granola baby it was good let me show you the yogurt that i used i am using this yogurt because it's dairy free and you guys it's so good it's so so good i thought it was gonna be nasty but it was really really good it actually tastes like banana pudding since i've had had covid in january i've been having my respiratory issues so i actually went to the doctor yesterday if you recall well not yesterday the day before yesterday i went to the doctor on thursday or wednesday one of those days i went but I want to follow up on that because I've been having my respiratory problems and it has been affecting my breathing. So I am prone to getting bronchitis, but now my doctor was saying it seems like I have chronic bronchitis as a result of having um, COVID because my chest every morning that I wake up, it's so much congestion in there and it just will not go away. I've been, okay, I had COVID in January, here it is September. So hold on a second. I'm gonna go take a pulmonary functions test because I've been having some wheezing too. And one of my subscribers, I forgot who it was. I'll put her name there, but she noticed it in my last video. She said, Anita, she said, your breathing doesn't sound right. You need to get that checked out. And it's funny because I thought the same thing and you're right because, but it does have to have to do, I ran up the stairs that day, but I do have the long-term effects from, um, from COVID, it was something I wanted to show y'all. Oh, so I I got a, what is it? A butyrol, 
that what it is? The little inhaler thing. She gave me that for emergency. She wanted me to wait. My doctor wanted me to wait until after I go take this test. But I was like, child, if I have problems breathing, I can't wait because I might have asthma now or something. Because when she listened to my lungs, there's a little bit of wheezing in there. But I had an x-ray and my lungs are clear and there's no mass or anything on it. It's just as a result from that. So hopefully they'll be telling me what's wrong or, you know, give me something that will treat it because it's annoying. It's very annoying. So comment down below and if, let me know if you had COVID and if you had it, if it, you had any like long-term effects. So I'm just curious. Uh, so this is the backyard. Let me put those lights up there on the house. That's that. And then the fire pit is going nice and toasty out here. Very nice. Good job, sir. Thank you, ma'am. <laughs> it's about the lights he put up there like a couple weeks ago. That's what they look like. They're so cute little twinkle light you guys happy sunday it's sunday it's 11 49 a.m i just got done marinating all the meats that we're going to cook for the week it's mainly chicken and salmon um they're up there working on the bathroom so and this thing i'm on my shoulders it's like a harness to help me keep my back straight from sitting at the computer and stuff for so long you know i start to hunch over and it makes my back hurt but let me just show you what i um have prepped so far here i have three types of chicken marinating and I used these packs right here. I used a mesquite pack. I used a chipotle pepper pack. And I used a zesty herb pack. Because with the zesty herb chicken, I'm going to make margarita ch chicken. Um, and then these two chickens, I'm just going to cut them up into chunks so that we can do like bowls. So we'll do bowls this week. And then I have some teriyaki salmon marinating right here. Some salmon with some of this marinade on it. Mine will grow all this later. And then I got to run to the store because I got to get some veggies and stuff for us to cook. But yeah. That's what I'm doing right now. Haven't been doing much this morning because I was getting my video uploaded so I could go up tonight and be ready. And I was up late last night editing it, but it's good. So if you haven't seen it, check it out. It's a whole movie. So make sure you have you some food and some snacks when you watch it. <laughs> really good. Wow. Guys, right now I'm on my way to, uh, I look crazy. <laughs> I'm on my way to Home Depot in the grocery store because I need to get some vegetables. That are, I don't know if I'm going to go to Home Depot or if I'm going to go to, um, not Home Depot, if I'm going to go to Lidl or if I'm going to go to Safeway. I don't know which one I'm going to go to. But I need to go to Lowe's because I need to get some heavy duty trash bags and I need to get a new garbage disposal because our garbage disposal broke. So I got to get that. So that's where I'm on my way to. So let's go. Guys, I'm in Lowe's. I, went, I did go to Walmart, but I was talking to Kayla while I was in there. So what I got from here is some garbage paint bags and two cans of the Greek Villa Sherwin Williams paint for the bathroom. And if you get paint for a bathroom, get it in satin. That way you won't have those um, uh, moisture stains on the wall where it looks like the water is dripping down your wall. Hey, you guys. So I got what I needed from... Um, I got what I needed from Home Depot. Now I gotta go home and put these groceries away. I didn't film in Walmart because I was on the phone talking to Kayla and I can't film at the same time. But y'all see I got a club on this car. Let me show you. See this club? I got this because y'all know. I don't know if you saw that little um, on TikTok how those teens are still like Hyundais and um, Kias with a USB and them legs. Let me at least put something on here to try to forbid that from happening, if God forbid it should, because it's nothing worse having somebody take something that you, you know, work for and then tear your stuff up. That's not right. <laughs> but anyway, let me go home, unload this car, put this stuff up, finish prepping this stuff um, for the week, <sighs> and then I'm gonna work out. And that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go make me a smoothie too. I'm hungry. All right, I'll see y'all when I get there. So good, it looks so good. All right, so it's looking really, really good. I'm loving it. Loving it. Guys, so it's later and I've been home for a little bit. I'm just getting the sides ready for dinner because you know, Lonnie's gonna cook everything on the grill because y'all know I don't mess with the grill. So um, I just prepped some potatoes that I'm gonna roast. Let me show you. I'm gonna roast these potatoes. 
Um, I'm gonna cut up this cucumber, slice up these peppers so they can be grilled and cut up this zucchini and squash so that can be grilled because what I do this week too is be able to make like little bowls, like, um, like, like salmon bowls or chicken bowls. So then it's easy for us to just do and I don't have to come home and cook and I can focus on other things because y'all know if you cook every night, when I usually cook every night, it takes a lot of time. Like, and I could be exercising or doing something else. Like y'all know I like to eat. Like I really have to get my weight under control and I can't do that if I'm not exercising. So I'm gonna prep this food, cook it at home so I won't be eating out and we won't be eating out and we can be a little bit healthier, try to be anyway. So that's what we're about to do. You guys, so I have the peppers all ready to be grilled. So I have um, yellow peppers, orange peppers down there, red peppers, green peppers, and some red onion. So the peppers and onions are ready. Guys, I have the zucchini and the squash all cut up. I know it looks like a lot, but we will eat all of this because usually when I just do one zucchini and one squash, it's never enough. So this time I did two zucchinis and, um, no, I did three zucchinis and two squashes. So. All the zucchinis at the bottom so we're gonna grill all this in case you guys are wondering this is the vegetable seasoning that we like to use when we're grilling um vegetables and it's so hard to find this stuff i found it on amazon but it said like they're the, they're not selling it right now which is frustrating i used to get it at walmart but i haven't seen it there so i don't know if they're gonna stop selling it now or what but this stuff is so good and the chicken's marinated this is the um zesty herb chicken this is the chipotle chicken this is the um damn what is this one the mesquite chicken and then this is the um teriyaki salmon guys they are done for today and they have left so let me go show you what it's looking like let's go do an update the door is off bye bye door and that looks so good look okay so the floor is done the wall tiles are done. Still has to be grouted, but it's looking really, really good. Better than I thought it would. It looks really good. I'm really happy with the choices we made with the tile. It looks so good. Different. I haven't seen anything like this yet. So get out of there, Coco. Get out because the tile needs to set. So I'm really happy with what Lani and I decided to go with because it just looks really, really good. I can't wait until they get the vanity in because that's going to bring some wood. Get, get out of there gonna bring some wood elements i can't wait to put the black accents in it's gonna look nice can't wait to get my shelves can't wait to get it painted can't wait to get the shower door it's gonna be nice if you're wondering what that cord is that cord used to be hooked up to the jacuzzi tub but we had the electrician add that outlet and we're having him add another outlet right there as well so that um we are able to charge our phones and stuff like if we're in here or whatever. I don't know why Lonnie wanted another outlet, but he wanted another outlet there. So they're going to put another outlet right there where that cord is coming out at. Then that tiny little hole right there, that's where the tub filler is going to go. And then the tub that I bought has a central drain. So that's where the tub will sit on that. And that's where the water will drain out. But yeah, that tub right, that little hole right there is where the tub filler will go. So all the chicken is done, three ways. We have chicken for the, for the week, and then we have the fish. Then we have some veggies, we have this, and then like the potatoes. And then I also cook some rice because I'm about to make us some salmon bowls. So I made us some salmon bowls. There's rice in here, fresh cucumber, tomato, red onion, um, zucchini and squash mix, and I'm gonna add some sauce on it. And you, I'll show you that in a second. Just topped it off with some of this, um, uh kinder's organic marinating sauce a sweet and spicy teriyaki and then that's what it looks like afterwards yum yum this joy is good <laughs> it's better than eating out huh it better. yeah it tastes good it's really good you guys it's really good mm. Mm, mm, mm. thanks Kay, for turning me on to these salmon bowls Right, you guys i'm still in the kitchen i'm about to go upstairs take a shower and go to bed it's only 7 21 but i'm like hella tired i mean all everything is just catching up to me now and i'm and this dog wants to play i'm not about to play but i'm about to go to bed so i will see you later in the week bye guys happy monday it is monday the 19th i think it is 19th or 20th 
I think it's the 20th. It is 4.09 p.m. I actually stayed home from work today. I took a sick day because I was exhausted. Like I was just so tired that I was damn near delirious just because <laughs> I still hadn't caught up on my sleep from that night that I stayed up the whole night. And um, yeah, so, but look, um, I want to show you guys something because look what came in today. My curtains came in. So these are the curtains. These are not all of them. I told you guys, I didn't want to order all the panels. I just ordered four panels because these curtains you pay per panel. So they don't come as a set, they're per panel. So I wanted to try um, those windows out, try them on those um, windows first to see how they look. And then if I like them, then I'll order four more. So let's check these curtains out. They look really nice. Look at that, they look really nice, real nice. This is what it looks like. It looks absolutely gorgeous. It matches like almost the fabric of my couch. All right, you guys, I'm not even gonna lie because it took me like a minute to figure out how to put these things on the curtains, but I figured it out because this little brochure just was not helping me, but I figured it out. So now I'm just gonna, um, I'm gonna put these on there, hang it up just to see. I'm not gonna leave them up because while they're working on the bathroom, that's why I'm not putting anything out in here yet in the family room because I don't want dust getting all over everything and I want to get the carpets cleaned and all that stuff. But I just want to try the curtains out to see, to make sure that they look good or if I have to send them back. So that's what I'm going to do. But they come with these little things and then I'll show you. And then it took me a minute because I was like, what the heck? Because my other curtains had little hooks and stuff on them. So now I see how you insert these in here. So I figured it out. And then you can adjust the lengths with this little thing too. Y'all see that? Yeah. So the curtains themselves look good, but as you can see, the color that I have is blending too much into the wall. So that's not gonna work. So I'm gonna get that shade that you see right there. That is beige white. See how that's popping out a little bit more than that? Cause that's really popping out, but that is the color I wanna get. So yeah, ignore how it's hung there. I, some of the, some of the um, things are off. I just, these are all correct as you can see. I have to fix, I would have to fix those, but I'll fix them when we get the new curtains. And then I'm also going to get them hemmed. All like that, like right there at the bottom. I don't like all that puddling. I don't like that. I want them like this. All for the money, they're really nice curtains and they, um, they look really custom like people have been saying. But like I said, this color is not it. So I gotta just switch the color and then I should be good to go. So I'm gonna return these and then order the right color that I want. Good morning family happy saturday today is saturday september 24th i'm about to head to the gym i know you guys are like go to the gym you have a gym at home yes i have a gym at home but i also go join the gym and i now have a trainer so today will be my third day working out with my trainer his name is paris and i know he's gonna kill me probably won't show him in this video but um or i may we'll see but um before um they get here to start working on the bathroom I just wanted to show you where we left off at. So let me go ahead and do that real quick. On Thursday, Frey came by and he grouted the wall and it looks so good and he grouted the floor. I mean, they still need to clean it up, but yeah, but it still, it looks really good. So today they're gonna to be patching up the ceiling and they're going to be doing the painting. And so, yeah, I'm excited. It looks so cute, my baby looks so cute. I'm rushing because I'm extremely tired. Lani and I went out to dinner with our son last night. We had such a good time but I need to eat something before I go. And I just got out of the shower and I'm already sweating. But yeah, so we're about to go, so let's do that. All right, you guys, so it is later. It is like um, almost 11 o'clock. I just got out of the gym and I wasn't able to film in there because my trainer, he don't be playing. Like we get in there and we get right to work. So I worked out with him for 25 minutes and then I took a Zumba class. So I just got out of that. And now I'm about to run in loads and then I gotta run to Sharon Williams. Guys, so it is later in the day, it's like 2.07. I never made it into Lowe's because I forgot that I need to go home and take a shower because I had a massage appointment at 12.30. So I made it to my massage appointment and I just finished there. So now it's 
and now I've got to go to Lowe's, but um, I've got to have something to eat. I'm starving. I just had a piece of peanut butter toast this morning before I went to the gym, and I'm so, so hungry. So I'm going to go and do that, and I know if this vlog is choppy, y'all, I'm so sorry. Sorry about that, but I, um, I'm all over the place. I'm looking to see what's going on. But yeah, I got to um, go stop at Lowe's to get the things I needed to get, and then we'll head home. You guys, so I finally made it in Lowe's and I'm looking for these switches. So I need to get like the, um, let me show you. I need to get like one of these, I think it's this size. And then I need to get one like this. So let me find that. Here we are, I'm back home. It's 546. I feel like I've been gone all day. But um, yeah. yeah I mean, did you miss me? Did you miss me, baby? <laughs> <laughs> see, see how he does me? So look, I was gone all day, but now I'm back home and I'm tired. I, I, let me see. I went to the gym this morning, like I said, worked out with my trainers, took a Zumba class. Then I came back home, took a shower, went to get my massage, went and got a massage. And it was so good. It really released a lot of that tension in my back. I think I'm going to start going and get one of those once a month. Hold on, let me clean off my camera. So is that better? Yeah. And then, um, what else? Oh, I'm so tired. I'm so freaking sleepy. Um, then I had to go to all these different Sherwin Williams stores to find the paint, this emerald paint that's out in the car that I need to go get that we use for our trim, like our doors and our trim. So I had to go to a couple stores and to finally get that because the first couple stores I had didn't have it. So they called around, found me a store that had it. So I had to go drive there. And then uh, I had to go to Lowe's. And then I came back home and took Coco for a walk and hung out with him for a minute. And now, what about to do, Lonnie? What you about to do? I'm about to work out. You about to work out? Then I'm gonna eat. You're gonna eat? I'm tired. So, oh, but I wanna, no, I gotta, I gotta work on my video real quick so I can get it up tomorrow. But let me show you guys the candles because I did order a bunch of um, Bath and Body Works candles online. So let me show you guys which ones that I got. Box. Give a shout out to my girl Petrina because uh, she let me know that when Bath and Body Works was having a sale, so I was able to go online and buy me some candles. I was out of town when she told me, but it was okay because I was able to go online and purchase them. So they finally came in. So let me show you what I got. God, you guys, this box smells so good. It smells so good. As you can see, I bought eight candles. So I spent some coins, but they were on sale, so it's okay. Now I gotta open these all up, so let me do that. So you guys, so here's the candles that I got. I got cinnamon stick, white pumpkin, whole farmhouse, spiced pumpkin, and patchouli. And then I got old fashioned, let me get that crumb up, old fashioned cider donut, honey crisp apple, and sweet cinnamon pumpkin, and pumpkin pecan waffles. I won't use all of them these this fall, but I'll have them anyway. Let me tell, see how they smell. Cinnamon stick is just really good. I love cinnamon. It smells really, really good. So that's a good one. Mmm. The spiced pumpkin and patchouli. I like that. Pumpkin pea pe can waffle. Smells good too. Yeah. All right, you guys. So I'm about to end this vlog because I ain't talking about nothing. <laughs> But anyway, hope you guys all had a great weekend. I want to say if you're new to the channel, hey y'all, hey, I'm Anita. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to the family. To all my returning subscribers, you guys know how I feel about y'all. Y'all know I love y'all. Y'all know y'all mean the world to me. And if you happen to be stopping by and you like what you see, feel free to hit that subscribe button down below and become part of the family. Also, don't forget to hit your notification bell so that you don't miss any videos that I upload. And another thing, if you like the video, please remember to give it a thumbs up because that does help the channel. And if, if you are watching my videos and you're not subscribed what are you waiting for it's free it's free 99 and doesn't cost you a dime and i would appreciate it so so much but that's going to do it for this video guys i hope that you enjoyed it and as always i just want to say thank you so much for watching thanks for rolling with your girl i love y'all and i'll see you in my next video mm, bye